hottier. Hi. <laughs> so the worship today is truly about forgiveness and truly loving others, especially those that are kind of difficult to love. Mm -hmm. So here's my question for you today. How hard is it for you to forgive someone that you love that has hurt you? It's extremely hard. Do you think you can do it in your own flesh? No. So when you've been able to do it, can you tell us how did you do it? you doing today good so I think you heard what I asked your sister earlier when we were talking about one forgiveness and then two loving your brother may I ask you have you ever found it challenging or difficult <coughs> to forgive people that hurt you that you love oh yes I have and can I ask you what did you do to help you do it or do you still have unforgiveness towards those people sometimes I'll pray to God and ask him for forgiveness or for help. Does that always I'll work? Just, I'll take a deep breath and calm down. I like taking a deep breath and calm down. And I love praying to God. So what about when you have to love, when you know you should love somebody that's being really mean to you? Well, it's because God says you you're supposed to love people, everybody, even if you don't know them or even if they're like your enemy or not your friend. Well, sometimes I'll, I'll just realize something good about them or something that we have in common or that they like about them. So we I can't love them. So Nadia, when it comes to loving somebody that is really being mean or that you just don't like, or that we're told not to judge. How do you do that? It's a hard one. Um, again, you just have to talk to God about you know, how you feel, or anybody, honestly, because yeah, just talk to God. Do you find that it is difficult to truly love somebody mm -hmm. that you consider an enemy or who has hurt you? Yes, because you're Do you think that's how you grow in Christ? Yes. Because God forgives us. That's powerful. How can we ask God for forgiveness if we're not willing to forgive others? Mommy, how are you doing today? Hi, Lulu. I'm doing good. Okay, so um, you just asked me um, like about how forgiving people like how we forgive people um, and love the people that we um, dislike or um, do not trust. Um, how uh, is it hard for you to forgive people that you do not trust or dislike in your flesh? Oh my gosh, um, yes. So for me, and this may be kind of weird, um, I actually find it not as difficult to forgive other people. Even when I love them or I don't love them, I can very easily ask God to help me forgive that person or that circumstance and work on me. My biggest trouble in my life <laughs> has been actually forgiving myself. Um, I'll hurt someone or I'll cause pain and I'll ask for forgiveness um, and even if they give it to me or they don't, I know that's what God, you know, asks us to do. What I find most difficult and what I still struggle with is when I do that not to go back and pick up that unforgiveness of myself for causing that hurt or causing that pain. Um, I find that most difficult. So I actually work on <laughs> trying to forgive myself more than even other people, if that makes sense. How do you work on it? Constantly, um, not trying to guilt. I think guilt is a huge factor of going back and picking something up that's been released or let go. Um, realizing that 
God knit me in my mother's womb and he made me perfectly and whole. And even though I am an imperfect person in my flesh, I am perfect in my spirit. And so it's a constant battle between my flesh and my spirit. And I constantly have to seek in me, God that is in me, you know, um, and he resides in me. And that is who I want to act and part of and that's who I want people to see when they see me I don't want them to see me or my sins or things that I've done wrong or even things that I've done great I want them to see the spirit of God that is in me so for me to want that from other people I first have to desire that for myself okay and is it hard for you to love people that um, is your enemy or your flesh says do not love yeah <laughs> so part two to that question really directs me back to part one um, i don't think it's actually that difficult to love people because i always say i love everybody right now i may not love your actions or something you say but knowing that everybody has god in them who am i not to love them or who am i to judge them um I constantly work on making sure that one thing I've learned is that I have to love God and then love myself so that I can truly love other people. Okay, thank you. Thank you.
I don't want it now. 